Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, where we discuss mythology as represented in art pieces from ancient Greece. In today's episode, we will be looking at the silver roundel, a roundel of hats, anything having a round form. This piece was created in the 5th century BCE during the classical period in Greece. Art in the classical period is most known for its idealistic style, showing the ideal form of beauty, harmony, and proportion. This silver roundel depicts Perseus killing Medusa. Medusa was a beautiful human girl who dedicated herself to Athena, the goddess of wisdom and war, and became a priestess. A requirement of being a priestess of Athena was that they had to remain virgins. Due to Medusa's immense beauty, she drew the attention of Poseidon, the god of the sea, who fell in love with her. Poseidon succeeded in seducing Medusa and laid with her inside of Medusa's temple. Outraged by the betrayal, Athena decided to punish Medusa by stripping her of her beauty and turning her into a gorgon, which is a type of monster. Gorgons bear similarities of women, but have skin of scales, teeth of four tusks, and notably they had snakes for hair. Gorgons also have the ability to turn anyone into stone just by looking at them. Typically, gorgons were immortal and had were very difficult to kill, but since Medusa was originally a human, she kept her immortality when she turned into a gorgon. Perseus is a Greek hero whose father is Zeus, god of the sky, the most powerful of all the Greek gods, and his mother is Danae, a mortal princess of Argos. Perseus grew up on the island of Seraphis with his mother. The king of Seraphis fell in love with Danae, but wanted to get rid of Perseus, so he sent him on a mission to kill Medusa, believing there is no way Perseus would live through the battle with Medusa. However, Perseus ended up receiving aid from Athena, who provided him with a shield and Hermes, the messenger of the gods and also the god of commerce and bees, who gave Perseus his own winged sandals, which enabled Perseus to fly, the cap of Hades, the god of the underworld, and his cap enabled him to be invisible, and Hermes also gave Perseus a curved sword in which to behead Medusa with, and a magical bag in which Perseus could put Medusa's head. Perseus was able to locate Medusa, and he used the reflection off of Athena's shield to look at Medusa without being torn to stone, and swiftly beheaded her and placed her head into the magical bag. The scene of Perseus slaying Medusa is depicted on a silver roundel. Behind Perseus is Pegasus, seen here, who is a winged horse who is said to have sprang out of the blood of Medusa after she was beheaded. This piece is currently held at the Metropolitan Museum in New York City. Thanks for tuning in to this week's video. See you again next week.